hey yummies welcome back to our channel if you're new please go ahead and click the subscribe button down below and the notification bell so that you get a notification every time we upload a new video to the returning subbies welcome back welcome back i love and appreciate every single share every single like every single i don't know anything every single notification you are just appreciated here anyway moving right along i'm going to continue with the color series uh, where i show you different outfits that i've worn before in specific colors today is obviously yellow as i promised from last week's video if you haven't watched last week's video i'm going to link it up here and put it on the description box so that you can watch it as well it was green so yeah if you want to watch all things outfit inspirations especially for our curvy girls stay tuned and let's go Again, please excuse the noise. The parents are home, but it's going to be like wholesome content because you're going to be getting a bit of family vibes, a bit of construction on the side. You know how it is. You know, how, you know. But I mean, the content must move. The content must go on because I said I'm going to be uploading every single day for the duration of the time where I need to get to 2K. Um, yeah, by the way, please type road to 2K on the comments let's go guys like we're almost there anyway without further ado let's get right into it so the first um outfit that i want to tell you guys about don't mind the raggedy nails <laughs> is um the graduation outfit that i told you guys that i dream about like i kid you not this graduation outfit i dreamed about and the second one as well which you have seen last week in the green not last week i don't know i don't know when you're gonna watch this but told you <laughs> on the last video uh that you would have seen that i wore and i said i dreamt about it anyway this graduation outfit is a tossa um inspired look in fact it is a tossa regalia because it's called umpato and i chose the color yellow because it was like my first graduation i thought oh happy vibes and it looks good on my skin why not and i yeah i just designed this design in my head and i got it made funny enough like so many people copied it even the the other one and i got so mad i was like you know what, if you want to copy it at least acknowledge the designer because at that point i'm the designer like i designed it especially if i dreamt about it anyway i, I got that made so if you want me to design anything for you based on your body type girl email is down there um instagram is down there just dm me so the hat i got from uh a deck in in cape town if i'm not lying yeah i think that's yes that's what it was i got this other lady there to make it for me because i wanted a black one and there was a yellow one but i was like i don't want it to be too yellow because i was gonna wear black shoes the black shoes are from june june is a brand quality brand from um i don't know where else you can get it but i know acres um house as is um june so yeah and i've worn this outfit a couple of times after that and i like that about this outfit the fact that i could wear it a couple of times after that and it's not limiting it can be casual can be dressed up or down and i'm going to show you how i've incorporated this looks these looks wow these looks <laughs> um continuing from this so yeah this was my first graduation looking cute designed it myself and then yeah this is another way to wear it without the puffy vibe sleeves as you can see very youthful glowing yeah you can tell it was very long time ago okay not that long but it was a long time ago <laughs> okay cool and the other way i've worn it is i've uh, worn just the skirt and um wore a black shirt from the men's section from mr price and then the beads i took it from my mom i think i took them from my mom or her friends i can't remember but you can get the beads anywhere literally anywhere 
um, at your stalls wherever you stay. Um, oh, I just saw that the sun is going down. Apologies for that. Um, and then the bag is from Cotton On. And then the shoes. Oh, that stiletto, girl. Is that a stiletto? Mm, that thing. That thin ass. But it was very comfortable. I don't even know where they are. But they're from Mr. Price. And then there's another way that I wore it, which was at the fashion show. Uh, I just wore the top and I wore the sleeves with it. And I wore a high-waisted pants that I thrifted. And when I look at it, at the label, it looks like it was from Donna, like back in the day. It's Donna Claire. And then what shoes did I wear? Just the sandal from The Fix. And with that hat, the African hat that I told you guys already that I got from a taking in Cape Town. A taking is like where well, you get everything <laughs> from shoes, from hairstyles, from earrings. You know that type of place, like Marava Marava Stat, I think. So it's called in Pretoria. Yeah, that one. And then the next outfit is this uh, jumpsuit. It's a Kosi Kosi jumpsuit. I used this um, picture to actually enter for the Kosi Kosi runway show, which I won. Um, I think it was 2018 and yeah this jumpsuit I had to buy it because you had to buy a piece of clothing and model in it and then people are going to vote for you wow what a time and I want that you're going to see that dress that I wore on the blue segment because the dress is blue this dress is from Kosi Kosi which is at YDE you guys already know that and then next I have this a beautiful two-piece that i also got designed i didn't design this one myself but i had a vision in my mind and then the designer and maker of the dress basically brought it to life i can't take all the credits here <laughs> uh i just had an idea that i wanted like flare pants and they needed to uh feel very comfortable and loose because you know it's a struggle when you're a big girl when you're thicker when you're a curvy girl yeah and then the top came with it obviously and i wore it with uh cotton on shoes and that bra guys everyone wanted to know where that bra is from and i forgot but i know it was sent to me as a gift like back in the days from an american company maybe i must look like through my inbox or something and find them but yeah, girl, you cute. Anyway, this was at my event uh, that I hosted. Uh, it's called Old Bodies, a Beautiful Meet Up. Well, let's call it our event because, I mean, it was our event. Um, yeah, it happened in Cape Town. And also this um, two-piece, I've worn it several times and incorporated in different ways, which you'll also see as we go along. And then we have this gorgeous 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 um i don't know it gives me very uh korean um fashionista type of vibe um i got this dress it's very short now maybe i grew taller i don't know but this dress from Woolies. Uh, this was literally in malaysia i was in malaysia here and i bought clothes i'd worn uh woolworths voucher before i left and i bought clothes at woolworths like so many um that's why sometimes you just hear me saying Woolworths, Woolworths. when you hear Woolworths and it's in malaysia you must know that it was from that voucher <laughs> i love winning so i'm always attending competitions if you didn't know that about me now you know um and the bag is also from Woolies. oh that bag got me into trouble guys i literally got robbed but because i'm woke i literally grabbed um that lady i'm like what are you doing because it's open like it's an open bag there's no zip there we're at zara and that happened and it was like the last day when i was um about to leave to south africa back to south africa and sign that this lady i'm just like my passport my literally everything i was not gonna go home basically and i don't know how was i gonna do it but can we thank the lord who we, we strived to move through and we did the things earrings la visa Shades, it's a shade store in Claremont in, in Cape Town. Shoes are from The Fix. Uh, here's another picture of it. Woolworths love this picture so much that they featured it on their page. Um, I remember. And the choker is from Low Visa. There's another picture of me by the Patrona Towers. 
in the lane, she y'all. Okay, next, we're taking you back to the fitting rooms, darling, because that's what we do here as well. <laughs> okay, cool. Both um, these two are actually from um, Cotton On. The dress and the jumpsuit is from Cotton On. The dress is like a string type of dress, and I wasn't wearing the right bra for it here, as you can see, but you'd normally just not wear a bra or use the tapes to hold them up because the strapless bras when I show they unless if you take a pin and you close it up there and then the jumpsuit absolutely comfortable I remember fitting this on it was absolutely amazing it's nice for like a picnic um type of vibe or when you're going to, for a concert you see those custom Bosch concerts I see it it's it's the one both from cotton on right and then next Another way I wore the dress that I spoke about, the Woolworths dress, I took the dress and the bag, different hair, obviously, different earrings, but they're also from Lovisa. And then I paired it with this uh, sarong kimono from a boutique on Instagram. I don't think that lady operates anymore, so it's a bit useless to tell you guys about it. Um, the shoes are from Koshini. You can't really see them but they're like jesus strap on shoes <laughs> that's what they call them um and then we have this bomb ass jumpsuit Whew, we're at the fitting room here what the fitting room here <laughs> what the fitting room again um and the reason i didn't buy this because i really wanted it it's because obviously the girlies were out here and I was like, mm -mm. I was just trying to show my people different outfit inspirations for the event that was going to take place. Um, that I mentioned that I wore that two piece, the old bodies are beautiful meetup. Yeah, that's one is from YDE, and then another two piece from YDE. Um, it's like pants cotton pants with this flare top and I, what i love about this top is the fact that you can still wear a bra with it um and your girls can still be supported and you can show a bit of cleavage like it, it's not those restricting ones that will show your bra you know and then um there's another way that i, I wear that two pieces i spoke about and now here i was going to a casting a modeling casting and i paid with my abercrombie and fitch bag uh my shoes from cotton on um and a shirt from mr price i think yeah this one is on the women's section i alternate um from women to men depending on how i want the fit to be and then the earrings are from lovisa i was going to a modeling casting here yeah and then the next one we have this um cotton dress with buttons all the way down to the slit and i was going to church here with the famous bag from malaysia that i spoke about on the previous video <laughs> um yeah zara malaysia bag shoes true dress cotton on earrings definitely lovisa <laughs> and then another one very casual bodycon uh dress i love these from cotton on um they come in different colors and stuff and then i paired it with my shades from can't remember probably the fix ybe or mr price and normal hoop earrings that you can get anywhere uh and then those shoes cute 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 sandals from mr price again another way i incorporated that graduation outfit this time i wore just the skirt and um i paid it with the top from an, an insta boutique but this one was from a physical store in uh cape town what's the name of that mall it's um i forgot but it's there by ronda bosch where checkers is yeah <laughs> and then obviously i wore black bra so that it can look like it's one thing and um the beret i got Oh, from a lady called Lala, Funky Lala, on Instagram. And the shoes my mom got them from my dad in Durban a while ago. And then we have this freaking, freaking, freaking dress 
from YDE. This was at a friend's party earrings from La Visa. Yeah, this dress is just does the things. I'm gonna show you the back as well because I know I have the back of you. It, she's the girl that she thinks she is, but you can't wear a bra with her, which yeah can be limiting. And then we have this dress from Zando online. I wore it at the Live Grand when I was invited to an event for was I think it was oysters and champagne. But we went on like some cruise, basically. Um, and it was absolutely beautiful. I actually have a video. On oh! 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 You go, go, you go, go, yeah. go, yummy. Bring it back. Bring it back. Bring it back. Bring it back. Yes, girl. Bring it back. Bring it back. On uh, this day, and I'm gonna link it here, up here or there. <laughs> And it was absolutely amazing. The vlog, like, I look back at them, like, thank God I lived because now it's COVID. And, girl, mm, <laughs> you can't live. Like, you can't do anything. It's so restricting. So, thank God I lived. And that video is just it. So, I realized I forgot one item of clothing that I think y'all gonna love. Uh, especially because I had worn this in winter. Uh, I don't know how I missed it, but anyway, the first outfit I worn it, I had worn it like this initially, with um, the main emphasis is obviously the jersey. I got it from Insta Boutique. It's yellow, obviously. Um, I paired it with white pants from Woolworths. Those pants are from Woolies. Uh, the shades are the same shades from that place in Claremont. And then the beret was the same one that you've previously seen. And I've worn it again differently. This time I wore it with jeans from New Look in London. As I said previously, New Look, I think they have it online at... Um, I'm not sure which fashion clothing online thingy my Bobby has them, but New Look is the name. And then the shoes are True Words. Uh, the belt is Primark as well as the bag is Primark from London. And then lastly, I have this gorgeous swimwear that I'm wearing as a top now, which I got from Bacon Bikinis. And yeah, there you have it. Oh, this one was a bit long. I don't know why, <laughs> uh, because I think it's less outfits compared to the previous one. Uh, but yeah, I definitely am enjoying this and I hope it brings joy and inspiration to you as well. Uh, till next time, please subscribe, share the video, like, please like. If you really like this video and you comment, I like this, please put a thumbs up. Click on the thumbs up. <laughs> After that, click the notification bell so that you always get notified. <laughs> Click on the notification bell so that you always get notified when I upload a new video. Other than that, I'll see you next time. Thank you so much.